hi guys so this is gonna be vlog number three um i know i haven't done a video in a while but i just <sighs> well i'll tell y'all i'll tell y'all the reason why i haven't done a video in a while um so this is gonna be like an update video on where i've been and oh hold on a second my car is yelling at me um this is gonna be like an update video on where I've been. Every time I wear black, I have like lint all over me. Um, okay, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, yeah, this is gonna be like an update video of where I've been and why I haven't put a video up in a while and also a vlog, of course. Um, I figured I would do it vlog style um i don't know i didn't i was gonna do like a regular video like an update video but i figure i do it vlog style because i don't know i like doing these they're i like editing vlogs for some reason they're fun and um i like doing these videos and you guys really really like these and that's like the most requested thing now so yeah um by the way i have my camera on my dashboard it's like it's so ghetto <laughs> i have it like basically taped up there with duct tape so yeah if it's a little wobbly that's why i need to get like a, a mount like a suction mount that i can put up there um and i'm on the way to get my nails done gas is a dollar 99 right now that is so so cheap and i already filled up when i filled up it was like 203 202 but that's cheap, $1.99. I haven't seen it that low in a long time. I'm going to get my nails done. And um, I figured it'd be a good like, time to talk to you guys because I'm going to be kind of bored. I mean, it's, it's an hour drive for me to get my nails done. The guy that I've been going to um, to get my nails done, he's been doing my nails for like eight years now. And he used to be a lot closer, like maybe like 15, 20 minutes, 20 minutes away. And then he moved like to a different nail shop that's like an hour. Um, I'm If I don't look at you too much, I'm driving. But um, he moved to a different nail shop that was like an hour south of me. And um, he's been, he was at that one for like a year. Yeah, I was driving, you know, like an hour to get my nails done. And I've tried to see other people like to get my nails done but he really does the best like the quality of nails that he does he just he knows what he's doing the products that he uses they're just better like the acrylic like an acrylic with gel the products that he uses are really good like the new nail shop he had moved to like a year ago they were using a different type of acrylic and then he got them to change like all their stuff that they use all their supplies um but yeah he's just really good my nails don't break a lot when I go to see him like when I go see other people they just do they don't really care honestly on how good they do your nails they just kind of like do whatever I even tried like because when he moved I was kind of like experimenting trying to see if there was someone else because I really really I mean he's become like a friend to me almost at this point so I really like going to see him and I like how he does my nails but I was trying to um see if I could find somebody else so I experimented with some other people, but I even tried like looking on Instagram. Like, you know, there's a lot of Instagram nail artists now, just like there is like Instagram makeup artists. Um, and I went to this one girl, like her stuff looked really, really good. But then when she did it, like the quality of nails, it was just really, really, really bad. So he was at the other, he moved like a year ago to a nail shop that was like an hour south of me. And now he is at a nail shop that is like an hour north to me. He actually just opened his own nail shop. So, and he started it from scratch pretty much because the place that he he's in is now, it was before a pizza shop. So he like cleared everything out, like gutted it and started from scratch. He did it all himself and it looks really, really nice. And it's called Couture Nails, the name of his nail shop. It's in New Newport Ritchie, Florida. And maybe he'll let me like vlog his nail shop and vlog him, like put him on the vlog. I don't know. People, some people aren't cool with that, but um, I don't know. He's cool. Maybe, maybe he'll let me vlog in there. So that's where I'm going to get my nails done. So it's like an hour drive. So I figured I'd talk to you guys. Um, I'm still using the camera 
shot that I was using before, which is the Canon Power Shot Elf uh, 330 or 340. I think it's a 330. Um, just a power shot, which doesn't have a flip out screen that I told you guys I don't like that about it. I like it. Like it's small, it gets the do job done, but I don't like not being able to see myself. And also, like, I want to see that it's still recording um, because it does stop recording sometimes. And I want to be able to see, like, you know, how much battery I have left. You know, if the camera cuts off, I don't want to be sitting here, like, talking to myself and the camera's cut off. Um, so, matter of fact, let me check it right now. Yeah, so it's still recording. Um, it's kind of shaky. Shaky. 
It's Beauty by Gabby on Poshmark, and if you use my referral code when you join, you get $5 off your first purchase. My referral code is BDGHQ, so if you put that in, you'll get a $5 credit that you can use on Poshmark. Also, I did order a new camera. Um, I told you guys this a while ago that I was going to get a new camera, and I was going to start doing more tutorials, but I was waiting on um, selling my other camera um, my Canon Rebel T4i but the person that was gonna buy it did, never bought it and then everyone else that wanted to buy it like I don't know people just kind of bullshit you you know so no one ever bought it and then I, I put it on my Instagram um, to see if anyone wanted to buy it and I had a couple people it, well, like maybe 10 people or so interested but no one wanted to buy it like right then they're like oh can you wait till next week can you wait till this day that day so it's still not sold hopefully I'll, I'll have it sold soon but I didn't wait this time to sell my camera I just went ahead and bought my new camera which is on its way to me I should have it in like maybe three or four more days it's the Canon um, 70D and that's the camera that I've been wanting for like a while like a year so with that one um, I think I'm gonna be a lot more motivated to make videos and also um, it's just a better camera overall so it's, it'll be easier for me to film um, makeup tutorials because of um, well my old camera had autofocus but during video but this one is even better I never really used the autofocus just because it wasn't quick enough for me I don't like a camera to take so long to focus and I don't like it to constantly try to refocus and and that's something that the um, that camera does any of the can Canon like T4i T5i um, they still don't they're still not as great as when it comes to um, that autofocus during video as the 70d is so yeah because with that camera I always just used manual focus and I like whenever I would move or whatever I have to kind of refocus it also my eyesight is like not that good it's really bad so I could never really tell if it was like 100% in focus and um, because I use manual focus I have to like put something where I would be and try to focus it on that and then take it off autofocus and then put it back it's just so yeah, so hopefully I'm gonna be making, I know I'm gonna be making more makeup tutorials because I haven't made one in a while and just overall I haven't been making as many, make sure I don't miss my exit. Um, I haven't been making as many as I would like and it is, you know, that's what the basis of my channel was. That's what I started off doing is mostly makeup tutorials. I just wanna get back to, not back to only doing makeup tutorials or mostly doing makeup tutorials because they're not my favorite video to make. I like them, but they're not my favorite. Like, I like videos where I can talk to you guys. It's more interactive to me, even though you're not really there, but you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, I do like doing them, and I would like to have more of a variety, and I would like to have more looks. Because I, I still don't feel like you've seen what I can do 100%. And I, I kind of want to show, show that to you guys. how shaky this is it does have um image stabilization during video but I don't know. make sure it's still recording yeah i don't like that i need a i really like these lip glosses too this is the butter gloss from nyx and this is the color creme brulee they're really like buttery feeling <laughs> they feel really smooth like they're not sticky at all which i don't mind i kind of like the sticky glosses just because i think they last longer but if you don't you'll probably really really like these so other than makeup tutorials and vlogs because i know you guys really really like the vlogs um i put up a post on my instagram and i asked for video ideas or like video recommendations and i got quite a bit of comments on there um for some video ideas or videos that you guys want to see but just leave some more down below in the comment section and um yeah most of you guys don't follow me on instagram like only like maybe 10 percent of my subscribers follow me on instagram 
So if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's Beauty by Gabby, the same as here. And I do update a lot more. And, um, you know, times like this when you don't kind of see me on my videos, you can always check me out on Instagram because I do post there, like, pretty frequently, maybe, like, five times a week, six times a week, a couple times a day. So, um, yeah, follow me on my Instagram. And it's a lot, I think it, my Instagram's a lot more interactive than my YouTube just because there's less people. So it's more like personal. And if you, you know, if you inbox me or if you leave me a comment on a picture or something, I'm more likely to see it and respond. And definitely if you follow me on Twitter, because I don't get a lot of people tweeting me, I only have like, what, 2,000, 2,500, 2,200, I don't know. People follow me on there. Because I don't know, I don't tweet that much. I'm not really, I'm not a big tweeter, but I like to be. I like to get into it more. It's just, if you can't really interact with people, I don't see what's the point. Like, I'll tweet out stuff every now and then. Like, a lot of the stuff that I tweet, uh, not tweet, post on my Instagram, I'll do it on my uh, Twitter as well. But you guys don't tweet me, so follow me on Twitter and tweet me. I will respond to you because I, I mean, I don't get a lot of people tweeting me. I'll probably see it and respond. So yeah, follow me on there. I uh, hope you guys can hear me okay. I am on the interstate. I just got off the interstate, but I was on the interstate. And uh, I may have been, been a little bit loud. Somebody just got pulled over. So this camera just cut off again. This is what I'm talking about that I don't like. So I don't know what you last heard, but... um. I don't know, I said I was thinking about getting the Canon Vixia Mini that Trisha Paytas uses um, and some other vloggers use, but it has a fisheye lens and that's the only thing I don't really like. But if you guys don't mind, I'll probably just get that one because I don't want to spend too, too much on a vlogging cam camera since I don't vlog that much. Um, the other thing is I was thinking about um, doing like a makeup class, me and my best friend. Um, so if you guys would be interested in attending, I live in Florida. I would probably do it somewhere in central Florida, maybe like Orlando or Tampa, somewhere around there. Um, so if you would be interested in attending a makeup class, let me know. Leave it down below in the comments. And, um, I also want to do a meet and greet. Me and, um... Me and Star Milan here on YouTube um, talks about doing like a joint meet and greet when he comes down here sometime in October, probably like the end of October. So um, hopefully that works out. But if it doesn't work out, I still want to do one. So if it'd probably be like where I told you, either Orlando or Tampa area, somewhere in Central Florida. So if you want to see, uh, not see, but if you want to. Um, go to a meet and greet go to my meet and greet let me know if that would be something that you're interested in um and give me some ideas for venues like where i could do it star was saying we should do it at like the mall which i didn't think was a bad idea but if you have any other ideas let me know um i'm open to your feedback as always let me see how far i am i'm like 35 minutes away so that means i've been talking for almost like 30 minutes straight I'm just uh, like turning. I'm just texting him and asking him if he'll be on my vlog. <laughs> this is only my second time coming to his new shop. Actually, I was the, his first customer at his new shop, which was really really cool. He wasn't even like officially open yet, but he took me because I needed my nails done. So yeah, I was his first customer. So this is my second time coming. <laughs> I said, "Will you be on my vlog?" And he was like, "What the hell is that?" <laughs> Let's see. He said, tell me about it when you get here. This duct tape is so ghetto. I'm really hungry, by the way. I only had a smoothie. It's not like a real smoothie, but it's those, um, like those Bolt House Farm things. They're kind of like the naked drinks. I had one of those, and then I had, an, um, what is it called? those bars called a kind bar that's all I had I'm really hungry 
kind of want some Taco Bell. I can eat a lot at Taco Bell, by the way. I like the Crunchy Taco Supreme. And I like the, I like everything on the menu, honestly. But those are, that's what I normally get, like the Crunchy Taco Supremes. I can eat like five of those, or probably even six. I normally get that. And I get, sometimes I'll get a Soft Taco Supreme. And uh, sometimes I'll get like a burrito. But mostly I get the Crunchy Taco Supreme. I love those things. And I like the Fire Sauce. I normally get all the sauces and I'll put like a different sauce on each one, but I like the hot one, the fire. They have hot and they have fire, they have mild, they have verde. They used to have some sort of like chipotle sauce, not chipotle, like chipotle, but some like smoked pepper. It was like in a dark red package. But yeah, I'm hungry, I'm really, really hungry. And my head's starting to hurt, which probably means I need to drink some water too. I don't really drink a lot in general though. Like anything, like juice, water, tea, milk. I don't really drink a lot of fluids. And I don't know why. Oh, I didn't even, I forgot to tell y'all. While we were on the topic of health, I should have brought this up um, and me not feeling well. It was like maybe two weeks ago, I actually fainted in my bathroom. And um, yeah, it was kind of bad. And I had, bust my eye my eye was had like a scratch here I still have like a scar there hopefully it'll go away um, but yeah it was black and blue and it was swollen it was bad but I'm okay I probably should go see the, the doctor though just just for a general checkup and just to make sure everything's okay like because I know why I fainted because I took some something to use the bathroom and I didn't drink, I don't think I drank enough water with it. And I've had that happen to me before. That's not the first time. Um, but it wasn't, it was one of those teas, like those cleansing teas. I fainted off those like two times in my life before. So I can't drink those. When you drink those, you're supposed to drink like a lot, a lot, a lot of water. So that's what happened. Um, but I think if I just drink more water in general, I won't have to take stuff to use the bathroom. <laughs> That's always been a problem for me though, like going to the bathroom ever since I was like little. Like I can go like a week. I've even gone like two weeks before, which is it's not good. And I think it's just not drinking enough fluids. My mom is the same way. That's why she drinks, she actually drinks those teas though to help her use the bathroom and she can't go without drinking it. And I also don't, don't want to become dependent on something like that, like having to take something to go. Because then you really won't be able to go unless you take it. So yeah, I just need to work on drinking more water. And I probably should schedule an appointment to see the doctor sometime soon, just to make sure everything's okay. And then hopefully I'll be on my way to feeling better, having more energy. And, um, the other part of that the not having energy is probably I need to start being more active like I need to start working out too because they say when you're active and when you work out you actually have more energy to do things um, so I probably should start working out I have a gym where I live in my apartment complex it's open 24 hours I just never been <laughs> so yeah I was um taking those multivitamins and I was taking a B12 vitamin and then I also was taking a iron uh, vitamin with uh, vitamin C. I don't know if it's been helping but I still just keep on taking it because I know it takes some it takes some time for those things to build up in your system it's like it's not like an immediate thing so So I'm at the nail shop. Let me see if he's gonna let me vlog in here. Um, this is his nail shop. It's called Couture Nails. And I don't have the address, but I'll put it down below for you. I just wanna show you guys the nail shop. They're like closed now, so it's kinda dark and stuff, but he's not completely done, but this is, what he has so far. 
Like a little couch, chair. And yep. So that's everything. <clears throat> if you come here, um, I'll put the link in the description to the the address. And if you come here, just say Gabby sent you. They are doing a 25% off uh, grand opening special. Hi. What's up? You want to say anything? No, I do. <laughs> yeah, so um, come check it out. He's really, really good. So I'm leaving now from the nail place. You're it's really dark, it's like 8.30 right now, so you probably can't see my nails, but I'll, sh I'll do a separate, I'll do it later, I'll show you what my nails and my toes look like. Um, they're really, really cute, I got them a lot shorter this time, but I like them. I'm gonna go to Taco Bell because I'm really, really hungry. They were actually feeding me in there too. They gave me some beef jerky, some cheese, bottled water. Yeah, it was, it was cool. Cause they were, they were pretty much closed and I was the only one there. Um, and I got to see his little daughter. She's so cute. Look at this. Look at this. It's a, can you see that sign? It is a KFC and a Taco Bell. And one. I've never seen one of those before. Weird. Let me get um three, four crunchy taco supreme. Okay, all I have so far is four crunchy taco supreme. Look, let me make that three. Three crunchy taco supreme. Yes, and one soft taco supreme. Okay. And that's it. Five ninety-five for a Sunday. Thank you. Okay, thank you.